For today's Monday Makeup Lesson, I'm going to show you how to create this look and it's such an easy, soft, glam look. Now, if you enjoy these type of videos, please give this video a thumbs up and let's get started. I've applied primer all over the lid. This is going to give the eyeshadow something to hold on to and also create a blank canvas for us to work on. This is the palette that we're using today. It's the Emily in Paris palette. Now, I'm not really a fan of the show and I'm not usually a fan of palettes that aren't square or rectangular, but this palette just won me over and it's perfect for February because it's a heart. And I'm going to be applying that using the Blank Canvas Cosmetics One Stop Eye Brush Set. Starting with this flat fluffy brush, I'm going to be applying this all over the lid. It's important to very slowly build this up. Press as you go. And as you can see, I've only coated one side of the brush. Now this is to prevent the eyeshadow from being applied too high in the crease. However, as you apply this, you're going to slowly have less and less product on the brush. And then what you can do is you can flip the brush around and that way you end up dispersing the eyeshadow upwards, but still not applying too much. Now taking that pencil brush, this is from that same set, I'm going to be applying this all over the lid. Now this has a hint of shimmer in it and that adds a little bit more depth because it adds that kind of texture in there. Now taking that pencil brush again, I want to add a little bit more depth just to catch the light, beautiful glossy kind of finish, but it's still really wearable at the same time. So you don't have to be worried about it being too shimmery. And then you should end up with something that looks like this. Taking a clean brush next, I'm going to very lightly blend over the eye area. To finish the look, I'm taking the lightest eyeshadow on the inner edge just to catch the light. It would also look great just underneath the brows as a touch of a brow highlight. Before I apply mascara and lashes, I'm going to sweep a mixture of the bronze tone underneath the eyes. This is using the pencil brush. Again, totally optional. I just find it adds a little something extra to that little bit more defined look. And there you go. That is the finished look. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. As always, my friends, be kind to yourself, be kind to others, and I will see you in the next one.